So digital keyboards are great and they are really convenient. And some of them even have decent actions that I like. But of course, what could be better than having all of the convenience of digital with the performance of a modern grand piano action? And this project is inspired by some of the other work I have seen. It is impressive stuff. Here is the basic design that I'm going with. It's a different approach than the projects I have seen. I would consider this more of a research investigation than something with a good chance of, of actually succeeding. I don't know, maybe the design will change as I go along, but the design is 100% digital, and I am really going for all out performance and computational horsepower. Okay, so there is the key, the action, the hammer, the proximity sensor for hammer bounces a light to measure the dynamics of hammer motion. I plan to use an N input A to D converter going to a microprocessor local to the keys. That microprocessor is doing the numerical computations to calculate the detailed motion of the hammer. There are 88 proximity sensors and 88 divided by N A to D converters with the microprocessor subsystems. Data is going to go over some sort of high performance shared bus and then to a microprocessor that is doing conversions, maybe MIDI, other features I have in mind. So this is just getting started. It's not done. And I'd like to make a video about some of my initial prototyping. I'm using a Teensy 4.1, which has a 600 megahertz processor, 100 megabit ethernet. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Here is the CNY proximity sensor testing this thing out to see if it's going to work okay. And I'm getting voltage levels where I want to be for the analog to digital conversion. And I think it is at least reasonably close for now. But this is going to need some adjusting because I am temporarily using the A to D converter on the Teensy board. It's 10 bit, samples fairly slowly. I want to go much faster in terms of sample rate, much higher resolution. I've got my eye on another part that I need to figure out how to include with this. But here we can see it is getting pretty good counts. So this is a simple hammer model I built to kind of make sure things are working. And this is the Right here on the oscilloscope, this is the response of the system. And after looking at this for a while, I realized, okay, I need something closer to the real piano action. So I found a single key grand piano action on eBay. I think it is used for training on how to regulate a piano, but hopefully it will work okay for me. Once assembled, then really what I need to do is attach that proximity sensor to it. Uh, before that, uh, just to note, the Ethernet board is a solder add-on to the TNC. I'll show that in a minute. So here is the CNY70 mounted right against the hammer there. And then the signal goes across to uh, resistors that are biasing the sensor. On the TNC, I'm taking the A to D converter and I wrote code to compute the signal, convert the signal to a velocity. The data, that data goes over UDP, UDP goes to the switch to my computer. I wrote a small Python program to get the UDP packets and convert the values to MIDI. And here is my first test with the full system. Okay, it's nice to have something working, but there's a lot of slop in this system that I need to improve to make it more realistic. So there's a quiet note Okay, and then one with a higher full velocity. All right, there is so much to do. Next, I'm going to work on the analog to digital conversion. 